No, you. You're gonna be my bitch tonight. Oh, wow. That's some fighting words from CJ Ladies Price. And welcome to Reekin Media. Those feel Let's see what we got here. We got ourselves a triple threat elimination, if I'm not mistaken. Is it with, uh, Yes, that's what I was told. Okay. With CJ Price. Oh, look at this. Two time former heavyweight champion, Big State. And. Supported by Nike. The, shut the fuck up, Drake. The uh, two time. <laughs> or the. Uh, yeah, the returning uh, Cypher. Uh, made his WWE debut a couple years back, but he's returned. Good to see him. Always nice to see another person around here. If he loses 100 pounds, he could be Dawson's defend. If he gains 100 pounds, he could be Drake. Yeah. All right, I'll or Midget wait. Big C. Yeah. <laughs> Into the cover. And C usually starting realizing that no one's going to get the win in the first minute or two. has decided to not do anything right off the bat. Do you think no. he actually really even cares? No, you know what? Um, His ego might get to him. Yeah, he's got quite the ego, and arguably so. I mean, you know, he could lose 10 matches in a row, and he's still t kind of a heavyweight title contender. And being in the ring with two lower lower people, if you will, on the roster. Yes. I, I don't, he, in his mind anyways, as if I'm speaking for him, he thinks he doesn't deserve to, he doesn't, deserve this. He should be higher up if you will. Yes, his ego's gotten the best of him. He feels like he's been there, done that, wrestled everybody, worked his way up, and one been to the top of the mountain twice, actually. Doesn't feel like he has to um, work anymore. Right. And uh, I think it's a bad attitude he's got going on, but... Oh, and uh, you knew that was coming. That attitude, by the way, rubs off on people. Oh, yeah, well, I mean, Look at he had a whole stable like that, you know, yeah. created around that, and... Drake had that attitude for quite a while. Aaron still has it. Price, though, he does. He has it as well. Oh yeah. So well, it's we a little more merited. Clash, though, in this match, Absolutely, or? but the the merited ego at one point, anyways, Big C and his two heavyweight title runs. Oh yeah. CJ has yet to prove himself. He's been consistent, but I mean, he hasn't gotten any major accomplishments yet. Oh! That's a big splash right there. Oh! Coming up. Shook the Four whole entire. All four turnbuckles moved on that. Just to show you. Along just, with the earth. Just to show you how Time much force. Time forward in about an hour. Right. A, a domino kick right there. Taking it to Cypher. Who did make his debut against CJ a couple years back. Ow! Short arm clothesline. Very impressive. Uh oh. Uh -oh. And he's caught. Uh oh. Uh oh. Big clothesline. Catches the foot. Showing yeah. his dominance. That's to say, we really haven't seen from him in a while, though. It's just, oh, there it goes. Never mind. Yeah, he's just kind of, you know, doing Giving whatever. him a compliment, and he fucks it up. Definitely. He's been rolling, still rolling with Aaron. Kind of almost piggybacking off his success. He was, he's been the number one contender for a few weeks. And that's going to be a big match later tonight. Aaron Douglas versus right. uh, our defending champion, Humberto. Yeah. Oh. I hope nice so. drop kick. And into a cover. Into a pin. And, uh, I don't think Price uh, realized that. Well, it is elimination, I think. I, I was told it was elimination. Oh, it is? No, yeah, wait. so, but you still have that mentality. You don't want the other guy to get the pin. Okay. So. 
nice reversal there. Arm drag from his back on the ground. You don't see very many people do that, but a big C, uh, it, it's a move set for him. He's on the ground quite a bit, and he's got the maneuvers to get out of that situation. There's a submission there. And bad, he's got some bad knees, really if he bad. Tends, he would have been eliminated, right? Uh, yes. Okay. I'm eliminated. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No. No, I think I'm the sorry. reason CJ May broke that pin up is he doesn't want to be in the ring with uh, Big C the whole rest of the time. Smart though. His goal is to probably get C out first. Nice basement drop kick. And C is reeling now. That's not good. CJ Price has made his return this summer. He was gone after he was released from the company last year. And I, in my opinion, he's definitely earned his roster spot back. Some pretty impressive matches with Dawson. Oh, nice. Very good stuff right there. Cypher has some flashy moves in his arsenal. Most people in WWE may not remember, but he, he did break out some pretty cool stuff back at Collision Course 09. I don't mean to cut you out, but I think Big C just got a little upset there. Because Cypher just took a move that Big C uses actually. Not as often as he used to, but he yeah. still does. That's true. It's still a, it's still a Big C move, and uh, he, he's probably going to be offended by that, but you know, he's got an opportunity right here to take it out. I rate by CJ, a little dirty. Well, we see that constantly. And again, folks, this is elimination, just to uh, clarify. Word up. Yeah, well, uh, Cypher's debut back in 09 was a show that Big C won his first heavy heavyweight title in what many people will call the best match in WWE history, the 2009 Six Pack Challenge. Oh, yeah. 45 minute classic. I mean, longer than some That's shows. One of the shows when I I debuted here myself, actually, because yeah. that was one of my favorite. I remember you called that match. Uh, yes, I remember you, that was one of your uh, on, big man. first matches you called back in 09. And that was actually the year CJ came in as well, 2009. He yeah. came in that summer. It was a good summer. Yes, uh, it's pretty pretty intense stuff. Justin Moore was the champion back in the day. I was trying to take the title from him. Who? Yeah, exactly. You want to see something cool? Huh. CJ is going to show us hey. something cool. Hey. Oh god. Whatever that may be. Now the two Eagle Maniacs might be tearing them apart. Poor Cypher. Oh. Oh. Neckbreaker. Fascinating. Oh! <laughs> and Big C does not give a fuck what CJ's got to show. I think he was going to go for a basement dropkick and Big C cut him off at the pass, if you will. Yes, Big C doesn't want to see CJ, you know, try to show off them. He doesn't care. C wants to win to remind everybody how dominant his falling oh. headbutt. Difficult for the Flash up. Kamala headbutt. Flash up. No. <laughs> People, some of the fans want to see Cypher get his ass, ass kicked. Oh. Very nice crossbody. <laughs> Big C goes right into. Oh no, choke! He's choking him. Go. Come on, C. You're dirty. Hey, how long before C does a roll blow? What about that? I gave him five minutes. Sooner than that, if he does. Five minutes or less. If he hasn't done it in the match Mafia yet, kid. you never know. Yeah, you know, it's amazing. It's fucking amazing how oh! it. Nice and Seguri. Oh, and he got Cypher hey, he with it. Cypher on the way down. <laughs> oh, man. That sucks. Cypher had no idea that was coming. Couldn't protect himself at all. And now everybody's down. That could have been bad. Yes, that absolutely could have. That could have been real bad. Oh! Little uppercut to the gut right there. Oh. Kick to the gut. Sweep DDT and move I uh, I use myself. And uh, Cypher likes to use now too, I guess. So I remember, I remember CJ and Aaron, they, they also the came from the same the league as well as Cypher. And those guys come in, you know, with background wrestling experience a little right. bit. Right. And they use their own set of moves and they don't know who's got what oh. here. Right. So uh, unfortunately, just using a move that someone else uses is offensive. You know what I mean? Extremely. Yeah. That goes back to the days of when you and Olin feuded. That's how you do it. Yes, uh, that was the first Pick ever up. issue Pick over a finisher in 2004, finisher, 2005. Finisher yes, yeah, we might have to have one or two of these coming up. I, I'm the new commissioner, as you know, so uh, right. if need be. Yes, yeah, so Lynn had some issues. Uh, I'm popular in the locker room. He cut me down to commentating like one match a show. Well, yeah, I, I'm glad that uh, Cypher's back now. I'll try to get him signed up, at least for a, a short-term contract. Oh! Big oh! scoop slam. We saw him hit that on Drake a few shows ago at uh, Crossfire. Really impressive to hit hit that move on big eyes. Oh, jeez. Uh-oh. No Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Stack him! Oh! That sucks, dude. That's I do not feel 
I feel for Cypher right there. That can't feel good. Cypher gets up. Nobody's been eliminated to this point. Fucking rest, man. We got a good card for us. All three championships on the line tonight. Right. Hybrid title coming up next. We got Eric Drake, Evan Payne. In. And a Falls Count Anywhere's match. Oh. And uh, Brian Lynch going to hope for his uh, oh. his wacky there, Evan, to uh, oh, finish off Drake. Oh. Oh. Double shoulder tackles. Not working. Oh. Uh oh. Oh, oh, they got him. It was a matter of time, though, before that you, we would see the two smaller guys Ow. going after Big C. It's just a survival instinct. It's, Cypher and CJ do not like each other. They never have. I don't think they ever will. Good insiguri there by CJ. No, I don't mean to go uh, back to the pa last subject, but the for the hybrid title. False count the, anywhere, sir. The last false count anywhere's match wasn't that Bouncer versus Aaron. And yeah, that was that a hell was a of great a match. match. Still a match of the year contender you think for this, sure. You think this match could possibly top it? Fuck no. No, I'm just kidding. Maybe it's, it's possible. It's, it's absolutely possible. I mean, uh, I mean, with a former heavyweight champion, Jack oh, Power Slam, two-time heavyweight champion, Cipher gets it. Cipher's got some explosive moves in his arsenal and definitely wants to make a statement in his, uh, his return to WWE. Uh, I know he's been itching at, um, to, to get back in the ring. And you got to admire somebody with that kind of uh, passion and intensity, that's for sure. You think Big C's playing possum? Uh, I think he is enjoying the fact that he's not getting his axe kicked right right now, but he does like doing the axe kicking. O'Connor roll, and he holds he it. He still held on. Oh! Huge German Chaos theory. It's the Cypher theory. <laughs> Cypher Hill. Oh my God. CJ's get trying to get back up. Cypher, yeah. Oh, no. Oh, Woo! Belly to belly suplex. CJ barely got over for that. Oh, CJ just, just hung on there. Also, to run down the rest of the card. Following that, we got a Supreme title match. Bouncer's going to try with his new attitude to take the title off of Anarchy. Uh, those guys were buddy buddy, but not anymore. Uh, Bouncer just lost his cool and his temper. And then to follow that up, that match I made earlier, the two out of three falls match with a big stipulation attached to it. Oh. I got tranquilizers. What? Oh, oh. Sorry. Between Dawson and Owen? <laughs> yes, Dawson and Owen. Oh. oh, Jesus. Turns him inside out there. Oh. Really? Really? Is that what we're doing now? They're having an issue over uh, who's gonna pin who. It's elimination! But. Getting greedy over the pinfalls. This is really. It doesn't They're matter fighting. who eliminates the first guy. Uh oh. Oh! Double choke slam! Long time ago, that's how Big C won the tag titles by himself. Double pin. And double very, elimination. Very reminiscent. Welcome back, Cypher. But uh, Big C wants, wants gold, and he, he decided to make a statement here. Somebody's good next. Oh, 